So Spirit tells me you've been feeling a little lost and a little confused and a little bit off the beaten track. So let's see what message of guidance comes through to help you gain clarity and get you back on track. All right, Page of Swords. There is going to be some information that will be given to you that's going to give you this revelation, this epiphany. There is knowledge. In this Page of Swords here, she is holding up light bulbs. And I feel like you're going to have several light bulb moments, realizations, epiphanies, just a huge revelation. It's almost like the confusion is being lifted. That veil of confusion is being lifted and you're finally seeing clarity because there's information in that book that she's holding coming to you that is going to give you the clarity that you need so that you can move forward in a way that's going to bring you stability, clarity and peace of mind I feel is coming through really strong for you here as well. You've got the Knight of Pentacles. I do feel things are going to start to mellow out for you. The energy is slowing down. The energy is going to start moving in a much more stable, much more reliable way. And things just feel that once you've got this clarity, once you've got this peace of mind, all of this anxiety, all of this uncertainty is going to slow down and just put you on a level playing field, on a path of calm, serene energy. You've got the Nine of Cups as well, which is just lovely to see. You've got your wishes being fulfilled here. I feel like there's going to be a lot of opportunities coming your way that's going to give you every reason to be proud of yourself, be happy with yourself and just feel connected with the universe feel more connected to people around you. It's almost like you've lost your sense of self, your sense of worth in yourself, sense of self-identity. And you're moving away from that. It's almost like you're suddenly realizing your value, suddenly realizing your worth. And things are starting to make sense in a way that is just beautiful. You are going through a metamorphosis. You are going through the death and rebirth card. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, but I feel this is more about your metamorphosis, your transformation, your transition into a place that is going to help you to see the light. And in this image here in the Lightseer's deck, you've got this star just shining really brightly through the cape. And it just feels clear. It feels like things are making sense. It just feels like everything is just finally making sense. All of these doubts, all of these uncertainties, all of this instability, it's shifting, it's changing. And it's giving you the Nine of Cups energy of your wishes being fulfilled, just feeling happy, elated, clear, just whatever weight of the world has been on your shoulders, this is being lifted and giving you a really smooth and long lasting, stable and responsible feeling of just things coming into alignment that need to come into alignment to give you your sense of self-worth and I just feel like it's a very light feeling I feel quite lifted I feel elated I feel like all that heavy energy of uncertainty and finally knowing the truth, knowing my worth, knowing my value. I'm feeling your energy is coming through very loud and clear here that you're queen of swords. You're thinking through your situation and removing yourself emotionally and you're finally having this revelation, this epiphany. And you've got the Seven of Cups at the base of the deck here as well, which is bringing new choices. Lots of choices can be overwhelming, but I feel like in your situation, these choices are going to be all fantastic opportunities. It does not matter which choice you make. It's going to be the right choice. And you'll have the, the sense of clarity to be able to make this decision. There is no more confusion here. It's clear. It's a clear pathway to success. 
and Knight of Wands here. There's something very passionate, very energetic, something very high energy that's bringing you a reason to feel alive again. You know, you've been in this state of impasse, this state of confusion, this state of low energy for such a long time. Things are changing, things are moving. Fantastic. And then you have the Sun card coming out here just to clarify and confirm that this transformation, this transition, this metamorphosis that you're going through is a blessing and it's bringing you happiness, vitality, joy and success. Could be dealing with a Leo as well. Either way, the Fool card here at the base of the deck is coming in to say, take a leap of faith, trust in yourself, trust in the process, know your worth, know your value. And then all of this confusion, all of this uncertainty, all of this feeling lost is suddenly feeling like you've got all of the direction, all of the directions that you need to follow that route that you need to, to follow. To be on the right path. Interestingly, I've just split the deck and you have the tower card. There is going to be something that's going to bring shock and change in an unpredictable way. I don't feel like you're going to see what's coming here, but either way, there is something you've been holding on to, something you've been looking into and maybe obsessing about that's going to change, it's going to shift, it's going to move in a wonderful way. That's going to bring you your wishes fulfilled with that nine of, cu of cups and the sun, which is a big yes to go for this and trust in the process because this metamorphosis, this change, this transformation is bringing in a beautiful yet happy, happier than you could ever imagine new chapter in your life that right now you need to really trust in the process because I feel like you're doubting it and you're saying, oh no, that's never gonna happen, but it will, it will. Remember positive affirmations. What you put out, you get back in. So make sure that what you're putting out there is bringing in this beautiful nine of cups and sun energy of your wishes fulfilled, bringing you the ultimate success and happiness.